everyone. I hope you had an awesome weekend. This is the beginning of the week. It is Sunday. So let me say happy Sunday to everybody. <clears throat> and these were some items that I picked up within the last week from Dollar Tree. So let me show you what I have. This is the COB LED Portable Work Light. It says the side LED is 60 lumens and the front is 100. So side and front, you have two different light sources. You do have to put three AA batteries in here, but I really wanted um, something that I could kind of put in my toolkit, but just another light source here in the house. I thought this was great to pick up and have. If you've already tried this, please let me know. Let me show you the back of it too. So you're gonna put your three AA batteries there. I have a review for you and also showing you what I picked up. So I told you before about the regular um, cheddar rich cheese crispers. I did try these for cheese and herb. They are potato and wheat chips, two ounce bag. These were good too. So I definitely like the cheese crispers. I told you all I ran out and bought a box. Well, it didn't run out, but when I was in the grocery store, I bought a, picked up a regular box of, of the cheddar just because I thought they were that good. This says best when used by June 3rd, 2021 on the back there. These are by, I'm gonna say it's pronounced Mehi, M-E-I-J-I. -I. If I'm saying that wrong, you've done it before, you've actually spelled out a pronunciation in the comments for me, do that. I appreciate it. But these are the Hello Panda. They're bite-sized cream center with crunchy shell. Um, this is the strawberry flavor. I just thought the boys would enjoy these. This is a 2.2 ounce package, Best Buy, November 10th, 2021. And then I also picked up the chocolate, same size. And this has a Best Buy, October 25th, 2021. And these are the Wow O Gourmet one pound bag of candy. You get 100 pieces approximately. Um, these are fruit chews made with real fruit juice. And each little individual fruit chew, says squirts on it, S-Q-U-I-R-T-Z, just so you know. Let's see, see squirts, if you can kind of see that through the bag. You all, I just noticed that these say distributed by Target, S-M-M-D-W-C, out of Dubai. So they are made in Turkey, a best before on the back of November 24th, 2022. These are delicious. Let me show you the flavors. Tropical, apple, cherry, watermelon, strawberry, and orange. I put a bag of these at work because I do go into my office at least about once a week just so I can get things done in there. And I put a bag of these in the candy jar at work. And people in my area know, feel free, grab some candy. Love them. They're like, ooh, what are those? Where'd you get those from? Dollar Tree, big old bag of these for a dollar. So these two goodie products... This says it's a 10-piece economy pack, goodie ouchless, no metal elastics. These are for thick hair, and I really like these because even when I use these in my hair, I can double them up. Um, but I think I may send these to Idaho. I might put these in a bag for the girls out there. They have big, thick, natural hair. Um, and then this is the goodie ouchless, 15 pieces, no metal elastics, medium hair, another economy pack. So yeah, they, this company is called Gimme, no snag, 12 hair dry shower bands. And this is really cute. It even comes with, now these are the bands. They say up and dry shower hair bands, but it comes with a suction cup for you to put in your shower and hang these on. Isn't that wonderful? So as long as you don't have a drain that these could possibly fall down and get in, I say do it or make sure you put them, you know, somewhere in the shower or in your bathroom that these could hang. But I thought these were really cute. They are water and mildew resistant, hook and store in shower. Just trying to pull on one to see. Okay. Okay, yeah. So not bad. The shower hair collection. And Gimme did have other products in there. They had a hair clip and I'm forgetting the other one. <laughs> This is extra in-wash color absorber, absorbs loose dyes and protects colors. This is a bonus pack, 10 plus two, in-wash dye absorbing sheets. And they are 11.4 by 28.2 centimeters. 
Um, it protects against color runs, mixed color, and white laundry. It says for all machines, including HE. Just read the instructions before you use. 12 of these in here. I'm assuming every time you wash, it says place one sheet in rear of washing machine before adding clothes. Um, use two or three sheets for larger loads in new or darker garments. So good to know. Yes, read your instructions because I was going to say probably put one sheet in every time you wash. But for colors, um, well, I should say for darker garments or a bigger load, you're going to want to use more than one. Grab two boxes of these because I don't see these in there often. This is by Garden Collection. It is a garden edger, 3.9 inches by 9.8 um, feet. And my uncle and I are getting ready to start um, putting my garden together, especially definitely once the weather changes. But you see that just edge your garden. This is by Garden Collection. It's a jumbo garden bag, 30.3 by 24.8 inches approximately. Let me go in close for you so you can see how you can put soil in there. Say, for example, your potting soil bag breaks. You don't want to leave it open. You can put soil in there. I can see you putting like leaves, any little weeds you pull up. Use it as at your discretion. I saw a lot of Brillo, Brillo Basic products that I had not seen before. So these are Brillo Basics cleaning wipes. You get 40 wipes in here, which I thought were good because did you get 40 in the um, the Dollar Tree brand? I can't remember. Um, and I always forget the Dollar Tree brand name. Anyway. <laughs> This is an orange scent. I believe a citrus scent. So this is a cleaning white multi-surface citrus cleaner right here. And then this one is the Brillo Basics cleaning wipes with bleach. 40 in each. And they tell you, like, this orange or the citrus is great for cleaning granite, wood tile, glass, and so much more. And then the cleaning wipes with bleach is good for kitchen, bathroom, office, and more. And again, a lot of Brillo Basics products I had never seen before. Um, another garden item, these latex grip gloves by the Garden Collection. And they look like this. Picked up a pair in purple as well as in blue. So we're ready when we need to get out there in that yard. 100 years on, it's Bow Reaches. B-A-L-L-R-E-I-C-H-S. A Touch of Salt Sweet Potato Chips. What is that? That is a four ounce bag. Yep, net weight, four ounce bag. We already um, opened up one of these, ate them. These are good. These are really good. This company is out of Ohio and it has to have a, a best by date on there. It does say gluten free, cholesterol free. And just let me read the ingredients because they're very simple sweet potatoes, vegetable oil. Um, it says contains one or more of the following canola, corn, cottonseed, palm, or sunflower and then salt. So you have literally three to four ingredients, sweet potatoes, vegetable oil, and salt, but the vegetable oil contains one or more of the other following oils I named for you. So not bad at all. They were really good, like I said. Matter of fact, I think these were even a rich potato chip, if I'm not mistaken. Here it is. It is June 23rd, 2021. It's right there when you're looking for it in the store. All right, and the last thing, or items I have to show you are all the same item. Um, they are by Ioni. And I don't know if you or your loved ones have been raving about the Ioni uh, faux mink lashes, but my daughter loves them. So when I saw the display um, in the Dollar Tree, I said, you know what, I got to take the time to just look through these, make sure I'm not buying duplicates and get each one. I mean, she truly does love them. I, I held on to one pair when I gave her the last batch um, and I still haven't tried them on and I need to because literally that's all we have these days. Um, am I wrong? You know, all you have are your eyes that are showing outside of your mask. So I feel like why not throw some lashes on if that's what you wear or at least put on mascara. Um, I re recall being on the phone with my sister and, um, she's out in Idaho and she said, um, she was at the Chick-fil-A drive-thru and she was like, oh, let me find out. She said, the girl at Chick-fil-A has lashes on. She was like, not at Chick-fil-A. And I said, oh yes, honey, that's all we have <laughs> are our eyes these days. So, you know, yes, lashes, do the lashes. Um, 
<laughs> but let me get started. Okay, guys, something I learned after the fact, after taping this video. So before I name off these different ones, I just noticed, look at that. This was my first time ever paying attention to that, guys. There are names of these. So even though this says Natural Doll Light, that one, I guess, is also called Oasis. So I'm just gonna put it at the bottom of the video for you, okay? So that's why you'll see that name go across. Just wanted so you to know. Ioni 3D Faux Mink Lashes. They are 100% handmade. And I'm gonna try to start uh, and do this in the item number order. This is item number 686611. These are the Natural Doll Lights. The next item, 686612, Natural Doll Medium. The next one is 686613, Natural Cat Eye Light. This is 686614, Natural Doll. These are very pretty. The next item is 686615, the Wispy Natural Light. Next one is item 686616. All right, keep up, guys, because there are 14 total. The next one is 686617, the Wispy Spiky. Let me put those seven to the side, isn't that cute? Next item number. Next item number is 686618. This is the Wispy Natural. Next item number is 686619, the Wispy Natural Flare. We have item number 686620, Wispy Doll Full. Item number 686621, the Wispy Doll Crisscross. 686623, the Wispy Cat Eye. Item number 686625, Wispy Flare Spiky. And I have a question for uh, you ladies if you wear glasses. Do you find that with wearing glasses that these lashes get in the way? And item number 686626, Wispy Long Crisscross. Can you still wear spectacles and the lashes are okay? So let me know your comments about that as well. But these are the Ioni 3D Faux Mink Lashes. On the back it says, hashtag Ioni Lashes, hashtag Ioni Cosmetics. I've got to look those up on um, these social media uh, apps and see how some people's look. But my daughter wears them and she looks cute in them when she has them on when she goes out. All right, that's it. That's everything, guys. I hope you enjoyed this Dollar Tree haul. Um, let me remove these Dollar Tree reading glasses. I try to keep a pair in a couple different places. Like, I left my glasses upstairs, so I was glad to have these down here today. Um, but as I always say to you, and I truly mean it and will continue to say to you, thank you. Thanks for taking the time to watch this video. I know that your time is precious and there are millions of things you could be doing besides watching this. Uh, that's why, look, I have a million of things I could be doing besides doing this video, but I do, um, I, I shop at the Dollar Tree and I enjoy doing these hauls for you all. So I hope you enjoy them as well. Um, but I also want everybody just to please stay safe. Um, uh, spring is here. So yay for that. We can start hopefully looking, uh, forward to some better weather for those of us that had been experiencing cold. I think we all kind of had just jacked up weather, no matter what state we lived in, whether we weren't accustomed to, um, so, you know, and we're accustomed to getting, to getting snow and stuff out here, but it was a change for some states. Um, I actually could use like one more good snow day. We didn't get that type of snow where you were snowed in in. And snow days are just totally different, right, guys? Now that everyone's teleworking, 
when you hear snow day and you telework and you look on your job's website and they're like, for those that were teleworking, we expect you to continue working. And for kids too, they don't get snow days like they used to anymore. Um, at least my kids didn't. Any snow day we had, they still had to be online virtually. So, uh, but yeah, I, I, I thank you and I hope everyone has an awesome week on purpose this week. Let's make it a good one. If it wasn't that good of a week last week for you, things can turn around. I've been having horrible, just pain in my right knee. Um, but things have been turning around. Some of that pain has been going away. So I can get, I can actually like get out and start walking longer periods of time than I was. Um, so we have to be thankful for even the little things, right? Let's be thankful for all things, big or small. Make sure you make that a priority this week and take care, everybody. Mm -hmm.